Do you have a solution to a problem out there? If you do, then you pretty much have a business idea. You don't have to dig deep to come up with a business idea. You've got it within you, believe it or not. Hello guys and welcome once again to my channel. I would like to thank all my subscribers who've been showing me all that love. So thank you all so much for the love. I do appreciate it. It's actually quite overwhelming and it actually pushes me to upload more content for you guys. I actually reached 50 subscribers, which is quite impressive considering my channel is still extremely new. So I hope you guys will continue to enjoy my content and I'll do my best to keep the content as engaging and captivating as possible. If you're watching this video for the first time, then make sure you subscribe down below so you don't miss out on the juicy content I've got coming up for you. I'm going to be bringing you five amazing business ideas that are guaranteed to make you some money in 2017. So you don't want to miss out this video, so you better stay tuned and watch it till the end. One, start a blog. So I know starting a blog sounds a bit cliche because it seems as though it's all I talk about in my videos, okay? The reason why I stress a lot on starting a blog or a website is simply because you need that as a foundation to start your online business. Starting a blog is a great business idea to get started with in 2017. Now you can start a blog on pretty much anything out there that you have an interest in. If you're into traveling, for example, you can always start yourself a travel blog. If you love makeup, you can also start a beauty blog, for example offering people lots of different makeup tips, tricks, and other beauty ideas as well. Once you have yourself a blog up and running, there's so many ways you can actually monetize from your blog. That could be from Google AdSense, where you allow Google to paste adverts on your blog. When people go to your website, they access and click on those ads and you make some money. You can do affiliate marketing where you promote other people's products and in exchange you earn a commission. You've also got Amazon affiliates, which is another great way to earn from selling affiliate products on your blog as well. If you want to find out more on how to start a blog, then feel free to check out my previous video, which I'll leave a link below on how to actually start a blog from scratch. Two, selling ebooks. Ebooks are basically electronic books, so it's basically a digital version of an actual book. Ebooks are very, very easy to get started with. If you've got an idea, you've got something you want to share out with the world, you want to write a book, then it's a great platform to get started with. People go on Google every single day looking for information on different subjects okay so you're watching this video right now because you're looking for information on how to come up with business ideas in 2017 so there's other people out there looking for information that you might have solutions to a great way to solve that problem is create an information product that solves a problem if people are thinking about losing weight and you've got a good idea on how to lose weight you've got some amazing tips you can write an ebook on weight loss then you can always offer that ebook to people out there who are you know interested in losing weight so you can always sell your ebook in platforms such as amazon kindle for example you can sell it on your website as well so when people go there and purchase the product they can actually download it instantly so you don't have to worry about packaging shipping the products out to your customers because they can download the products instantly even if it's 2 a.m. in the morning and you're never ever going to run out of stock because it's a digital product so you've got basically a file that you're sharing out there with the whole world okay you don't have to invest a lot of money you know printing out the books to ship it out to your customers everything is pretty much online I'm going to shoot another video altogether on how to get started with ebooks so if you would like to find out more on ebooks then make sure you subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on that video when it does come out three social media consultant now everything is pretty much digital these days and a lot of big companies actually not a lot of big companies all major companies are now using social media as a platform to attract and connect with their customers. Either on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, Pinterest, you name it so many of them out there okay if you've got some sort of social media experience in terms of you know advertising and attracting customers using social media platforms then starting a social media consulting business is a great way to get started small businesses are starting every single day and marketing is something that every single business struggles with so there's always going to be a need out there for a social media consultant or a digital marketer or a marketer in general so if you've got some sort of skill and experience in social media then I strongly recommend you look into getting started as a social media consultant you can obviously start freelancing your services and there's so many companies out there that are looking for people to outsource the services to. So becoming a social media consultant is another great way to start a business in 2017. Four, drop shipping. 
Dropshipping is perfect for those who are thinking about selling physical products online, but they just don't have the money to buy inventory. So what is dropshipping? Dropshipping is a process whereby you sell products that you don't own, and then when a customer buys, you pass the order over to your dropshipping supplier. The supplier then packages and ships the order out to your customer, and ka -ching, you make some money. So how do you actually make money from dropshipping? The supplier's products will usually be wholesale, of course. So if the supplier is selling a perfume for about, say, £25, you can actually sell that for £50, which is the retail market price. The customer comes to your website, they buy the product for £50, they pay you £50, you only pay the supplier the cost price of £25, the supplier then processes and ships the order out directly to your customer, okay? And then, the ching you pocket £25, just like that. You don't have to deal with any processing, any packaging, any shipping or anything like that. Your job is simply to pass the order over to your supplier and then the supplier does all the hard work for you. So the customer will never know that the goods are actually coming from your supplier unless of course you tell them so shh, it's a secret so dropshipping is a great way to start your online brand of course there's pros and cons to dropshipping you need to make sure you're actually working with the right suppliers to start with because again there's a lot of scam on the internet so you gotta do your research right you can pretty much dropship anything from hair products to shoes to clothing to accessories some people even dropship water bottles okay so you can literally dropship anything out there as long as you find a good supplier that you can work with if you're interested in getting started with dropshipping, then I'll leave a link below where you can access the Income Reap Academy, which again goes into a lot more detail on dropshipping. Number five, affiliate marketing. Now I know you've heard about this a ton of times, and I'm going to keep talking about this because it actually works, okay? So affiliate marketing basically involves promoting other people's products and earning commissions. Ever wondered how a lot of bloggers and bloggers make money online? is affiliate marketing, okay? So if you look at YouTube these days, you know, you see lots of reviews from fashion hauls to hair reviews to, to makeup reviews, to pretty much different types of reviews. Now, people make these reviews and then at the bottom of the description bars, they actually leave their affiliate links where you can then click on and once you click to make a purchase, they earn some money from that. So you too could be doing that. So if you've got a YouTube channel, for example, then it's a great way to actually merge in your affiliate products. So I do affiliate marketing myself because I've got products that I actually refer people to as well. So if I come across some products that I think you guys would find useful, I'll always leave a link in my description for you to click and access affiliate products where you can then find out more information. So these are my five best business ideas to make you money in 2017. So I hope you found this video useful and informative in coming up with a business idea for your online business in 2017. As usual, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, then what are you waiting for? You better hit that subscribe button if you love my content and you want to find out more so you don't miss out on any new content I've got coming up for you. So thank you all so much and I look forward to catching up with you in my next video. Bye for now.